My nigga so cocky, he indifferent, he dame dash ignorant, but I refuse to be your mistress. He cocky, he indignant, he different, he dame dash ignorant, but I refuse to be your mistress. I refuse to live in de-stress, not even for a D or dress. Little baby cocky, he indifferent, he dame dash ignorant, I refuse to be a mistress. Usually, mistresses are mysteries, and I'm a full-fledged novel, baby, it's thriller, Mike Jackson type thriller, page turn up, and here's a clue, baby's in the library with a burn up, this hell's cat too good to be fucking undercover. What's up you guys, it's your girl Baby Young Baby and you're watching Snarky Black Girl TV. Jimmy hat, just don't come in me. And little nigga, you can't hit. For my girlies out there, this is the question of the day. When was the first time you ever felt true love? If you have not felt it before, tell me in the comments what you think it feels like. Cream, that ice cream is ice me, ice me, that new protect. I like if you it. chose number two, let's see. Oh, I'm gonna keep on going. I'm gonna keep on going. Oh, <laughs> number two. You got somebody, first of all, I don't even keep my cards in the reverse. And here he come out in the reverse. You got somebody that's trying to change their wicked ways so that they can come in and have their shot. And they are trying to race against the shot clock, Ella May style. I got here the daughter of coins. But look how these cards came out. They just all flipped around all funky. And they in the reverse. Somebody at one point could have been the apple of your eye. They could have been that person that you looked at and placed on a pedestal. And now you're like, move along, little doggy, Because there's somebody that's better for me coming in. If three of wands means that somebody is coming to you. So I think that right now, this is like that meme. If y'all ever seen it with Jesus and he's holding that big bear behind his back, trying to get a little girl to give him that little tiny dusty bear, get a little dusty bear up and take what Jesus really has for you because it's going to be good. Don't run. Don't run. Don't make me get my gun. If you chose number three. Oh, number three. You only got one card. And so we got the six of coins. The six of coins is about balance. It's about financial prosperity. And it's about getting out of life what you put into it. And some of y'all are putting in a little bit of luck. And some of y'all are really trying to roll the dice and, and figure out what it is that's really meant for you. And I think that right now you guys are about to hit the lucky number. That's lucky number seven on them dice. They got on their lucky clover. And whatever it is that you have been trying to get out of life once again is going to come back to you if you've been putting in that work trying to be famous baby trying to be famo i think you're going to be famo if you're trying to fall in love that love is coming to you or if you just want to have success in your career path i think that's coming to you as well so um this is actually about uh, reading about true love and i think that the true love that you want to come out of your life is going to come through your career and so uh, i'm gonna get one more card anyway because Ooh, listen to spirit. That's about confirmation saying that the love that you want is going to come in for you. But also this is about uh, listening to your intuition because the love that you want is going to come in from the inside. My heart, he got it. Option number four. Let's see. Let's see. What spirit got for y'all? Ooh, spirit. Somebody here, your father figure has a, a message for you. I feel like there's an energy here that you guys need to rest, relax, and take a load off. I think that there is some type of um, clarity coming to a situation and there's a resolution coming uh, soon. I think maybe in the next three months soon. Uh, but listen to your dreams and then pay attention to your mother figure, whether they're passed over or not, because this person is trying to talk to you about something and it's time for you guys to release the past. This could be uh, anything that comes in your way, but time will only tell uh but be aware that you know everybody ages your parents will one day age and one day your parents will be gone and this is also like a message i feel like where spirit is saying like cherish what you have right now while you have it because when you wake up and you open your eyes that person could be uh out of your life uh, either permanently you won't be able to see them anymore in this lifetime uh so there could be um death coming into your life here uh don't let that scare you though it's all a transition and so i think that once that love leaves your life in terms of like oh my parent i think that's when you guys are going to be able to align truly with the love that you want in terms of romance um 
And I feel like, yeah, the lover's card is coming in here. Like it's time for you to make a choice. And so maybe this is the idea that you don't want to wait for your parent to pass away to get the love that you want. And so now it's time for you guys to put a little distance between you and your parent, your parent. Like, you know, maybe you got a Matthew Knowles in your life and he's trying to make you his little baby, but Beyonce said, no, uh, Jay-Z, my daddy. This is like letting Jay-Z be your daddy, okay? And forgetting about uh, Matthew until the time is right. So this is about moving on from being coddled by a parent. My heart goes like a locket. And with that knowledge... All right, let's see what you got here, pile number six. Okay, daddy. This is the last. Ooh, this is the last one. But y'all got the Empress, the Emperor, and the Nine of Cups. Everything you think you want out of a man is coming to you. Everything you think you want out of love is coming to you. But it's only gonna come to you the more you walk towards that shmoney. And the more you walk towards that shmoney, I think the more you guys are gonna start to appreciate what you have in your life right now. And some of you guys have a. Um, a parent, a father figure, or somebody like that, that is needing your ultimate attention or your utmost attention right now. Because I think the more you like forgive and forget the past with the people in your life right there in front of you, that's the the more you guys will be able to uh, really fully accept the real love that's coming to you in terms of like romance. And so as you forgive and heal the past with your parents and heal those parent wounds, the deeper love you'll feel on the inside with whoever this person is that's coming your way and not a moment sooner, baby. Don't cheat yourself, treat yourself. Don't turn a blind eye to the hope at the end of the road because some of y'all could be a little bit older. Some of y'all have been waiting for love for a long time and now you're ready to give up. Okay, some of y'all are looking at life like, oh, well, I want a man that, that can read, but then uh, two years go by, you still single. Three years that go by, you still single. And now literacy ain't as important anymore, okay? Some of y'all want a man with a job when you're 25, but when you turn 30 and 40, you could care less if his ass is working. It's the idea, don't drop your standards because you think time is ticking away because time is irrelevant. The person that's meant to love you is going to love you whether you're 35, 45, or 55. And so if you begin to cheat yourself, you're going to end up in a situation that's uh, like a pattern or a replay of the past. And we're looking to walk away from the past. I want a divorce, but I will settle for a new point. All right, number five. Last but not least. Number five, watch number six. It's the same reading. Don't cheat yourself. Treat yourself. My heart, he got it. My heart, I baby girl. My heart, I have y'all today. Like, share, and subscribe to It's Not You Black Girl. Girl with a U, not with an I, girl. My heart, honestly, like a locket. And with that knowledge, he's so cocky. He indifferent. He dame dash ignorant.